When more than two months ago, the latest eruption in the Sundunka crater chains of the Swartzengi volcanic system in the Reckonus Peninsula of Iceland finished, it was so reduced in activity that tourists were even going beside it and taking a photograph. It was humiliating in a way for such a, a long-lasting volcano when it went cold and the tremors declined and the magma subsided. And the new cycle was already starting. It took it more than two months, actually, to build up enough magma under the ground between the rocks in the reservoir to finally erupt again this month. And the eruption was something like this. Beautiful. The lava from this uh, eruption was one of the fastest flowing ever. It covered parts of the uh, Blue Lagoon and the Sorsengi uh, area where, where is the geothermal power plant. You could see in the satellite images and it easily covered part of the road, cut it through. That road was closed. This is the road from north to south toward the Grindavik. That road was cut. But being Icelandic, the moment that the uh, level of the eruption reduced and the lava flow was entirely almost toward the east and the west side was a little bit, you know, quiet, immediately the workers and authorities started to build the road over the hot glowing red lava. Yes, that's true. You can see the evidence is here. The lava is glowing red, is hot, and the machinery go over it and open the way for the road and for the traffic toward the Grindavik. Never give up, never surrender. This is the motto of the Icelandic. They know how to deal with the volcanoes and lava flows. And despite the fact that initially we started with a lot of gas pollution, at the moment, the level of the gas pollution has reduced. Uh, as you can see here in this uh, beautiful view of the Green Davik with the Sundunka crater chain when the new eruption is there and the old Fegedesvio, the gas pollution is reduced mostly toward the south. So practically the immediate area around the eruption site is clear for the authorities to start to work. And already we have the next phase of the eruption with building of the magma under the uh, reservoir five kilometers down the earth grass as it started. We are waiting for the next one in a few months.